Coming up today, our sports brought to you by Coons Quality Foods all throughout the morning, eventually leading to the Coons Market Black and Gold Sunday Show. But sports will begin at 515 from the Barrel Cadillac Sports Desk. So let's kind of give you some of the things we're going to be talking about today on News Radio 1020, KDK Intercom Communications. The Titans rallied from a 21 to 3 deficit to defeat Kansas City 22 to 21. You move on to the second round in the National Football League wildcard weekend. Marcus Mariota threw for 205 yards and he also threw two touchdowns. One pretty incredible. He actually was throwing a ball towards the end zone. It got deflected back to him and then he raced in for the score. The late game at the historic Los Angeles Coliseum. The Rams lost to Atlanta 26 to 13. Matt Ryan threw for 218 yards and a touchdown in the win. But the big story, Julio Jones, nine catches, 94 yards and a score. John Gruden in Oakland made it official yesterday, but they will hold a press conference Tuesday. He will be the old new coach of the Oakland Raiders. Today, 105 CBS Sports, KDK TV2, Buffalo at Jacksonville, and then at 440 on Fox, New Orleans will host Carolina, and again, we'll break it all down today on the Coons Market Black and Gold Sunday Show. Now, Bill Hillgrove, 93.7 The Fan, Pitt IMG Sports. Cameron Davis, little jab step, gets it off to a driving. Jared Wilson Freeman, a hook shot from the baseline, ties the game at 20. All right, Jared Wilson Frame did lead Pitt with 20 points, but in the end, Virginia Tech got the win, 81-67. Up next for the Panthers, Coach K, Duke Blue Devils, coming to the Peterson Event Center Wednesday night at 7, and again, you can hear it on 93.7 The Fan. To golf, Dustin Johnson shot a third round, 66, and now has a two-shot lead heading into the final round of the Century Tournament Championship. He is at 16 under for the weekend. Brian Harmon is alone in second place at 14 under. Good morning. That's your sports.